We're in Phillipsburg, New Jersey, and we're here at the Ice Cream Junction, and I'm here with Frank Miller. And uh, Frank, you know, thanks for having us over. Let's talk about your nice place here because right across from the park, man, when you're sitting there relaxing, all you can think about is, boy, wouldn't it be nice to have some ice cream? Tell us about exactly where you're located here. Uh, we're located on 39 Sick Ray Street, Phillipsburg, New Jersey, and uh, right across from Chappelle Park. They have a lot of events down here, and uh, things that are usually pretty busy on nights when there's bands or uh, yep. different events going on. It uh, seems like there's more and more events going on in Phillipsburg, huh? Uh, yeah, they're Urban Enterprise Zone's getting behind a lot of this stuff and everything's starting to pick up a little bit. They have cruise night on Tuesday nights and movies in the park on Thursdays in the summer. And uh, during the holidays they have different things. Uh, there's going to be face painting in October. Well, and a couple the bike race like in the fall too. Yeah, the bike race. The bike race was good. There was a lot of contestants and people out wandering around across the street. And the best part of all that is, boy, everybody loves ice cream. So let's talk about your store here because ice cream is what you specialize in. And boy, everything looks great. Tell us what kind you have. Uh, we sell Hershey's ice cream. We have 28 flavors hard, and we also have soft serve, vanilla, chocolate, and twist. Uh, we make banana splits, floats, milkshakes, sundaes, specialty sundaes, hot fudge brownie, peanut butter cup. Uh, and if somebody wants it on ice cream, we'll put it on there yeah. any way they want it. Even if you got to bring it with you, right? Yeah. <laughs> you know, bring your. Own. It, so we always try to make them happy the way they want to have it. And, what are your normal hours here? Uh, we're open 12 to 10, seven days a week, uh, all year round. In the winter, it's 12 noon to 10, till yeah. 10 at night. And in the winter, we're probably going to cut it back, maybe till nine or so, and maybe close on one day. But in the winter, there's always something else you might have. And I noticed you have coffee here too, so mention that. Right. We I just started serving Green Mountain coffee. Uh, we're trying to get that going here. We have a little coffee station going here, and. Some people said that it's a good idea to have coffee in the winter when after you had some ice cream and you're cold that you'll be looking for some coffee to drink to warm up afterwards. Well, a couple of things. One is you used to have a place before. Where was that at? Uh, it was located on the north end at, by the toll bridge. Uh, it was about eight years ago and just decided to, eh, you know, I was doing some other things and I decided I like making people happy again so I said I'm going to open an ice cream place again. Well, you know, just in case people remember you, you had a place down there next to where you cross over the river, right? Yeah, it was uh, called JD Sundays. It's under uh, different ownership now, so yep. they're like yep. the competition, but, you know, yeah, nothing right. wrong with some good competition. Absolutely. So we want to encourage people to come in. And now, obviously, good ice cream. It's, what kind of ice cream was it? Hershey's? Uh, Hershey's ice cream. Yeah. Yep. Good ice cream. Yep. And no matter what flavor you get, you can't mess it up. I mean, it's good ice cream. Oh, yeah. And they're all, you have all these, what do you say, 26 flavors? Uh, 28, and then we have the soft serve, too. The vanilla and chocolate and uh, twist. Now, do people uh, basically buy what they're eating here and eat it here? They take some home, too? Uh, a lot of them buy here. They'll sit down on the benches here and eat it here, or else they'll maybe go over in the park. Uh, a couple of nights a week, there's the guys that play over in the park. They just gather over there and play some music. We call them the gazebo boys. and. You know, they're playing from country western to rock or, you know, just over there jamming a little bit. And people will go over and... I was going to say, if somebody's having a birthday party, want to pile everybody in the car, get some ice cream over here, go over in the park, listen to music, man, they don't have to have it in their house. Yeah. They can have it outside. That works. That works. That works good. Well, listen, we're out of time. But listen, let's wrap this up. What should people think about? When they're thinking about the ice cream junction, you got a little train running around in here. Just to remember, remind people about the train ride here in town. Uh, what should they think about when they're thinking about great ice cream and coming here? Uh, think about good service and uh, now we just want to make everybody happy and we're glad they come down.